Dear fellow students and faculty, good afternoon. It's my great honor to stand here as a member of class 2022 to make a speech at the opening ceremony of international school. For all my peers in the audience, a 12 year long journey has just been completed and the finish line was successfully crossed. I believe most of my fellow students were just like me. We studied hard at high school, putting as much time as possible in studying, trying to achieve a good place in the final college entrance examination. And here we are, receiving the rewards for our hard work in the past 12 years, ready to start a new life as a freshman of D9 University. I've never had a second thought about choosing another university over D9 University, which was my first choice and will always be. As someone who is not from Guangzhou City, I've heard about D9 University a lot. My mother is an accountant by profession. Her obvious preference for this school has impressed me so deeply that D9 University has been my dream school ever since. D9 University has all along been renowned as one of the best and oldest Chinese university in the past 116 years for the great achievements and contributions made by the faculty and alumni to the Chinese nation and the world Chinese community. And it has never ceased to be a bright shining star of human civilization by the Zhujiang River. Even comparing with other top schools, it yet has its unique point to stand out among them. It was in 1906 when Dina University was built, when the foundation of its uniqueness was laid. It operated on the principle to receive overseas Chinese students. And this objective made Dina University one of the few schools in China to have such tolerance for multiculturalism. And I believe that's why so many overseas students and students from Hong Kong, Macau, and Taiwan choose Dina University. Hence, there's the famous saying, wherever there is seawater, there are Dina alumni. We're students from all over China and even all over the world. We're from different provinces or even different regions and countries. No matter how different we are, we at least have one thing in common. We're freshmen of international school. College students as we are, study still remains as our primary task. Every good habit developed in your high school is worthy to be insisted on like getting up early for reading, listening carefully to teachers in classes, and reviewing lessons for refreshing your memory. Besides, here in the college, you are provided with the access to rich resources of books in the library, electronic documentations, and lectures by experts. Anything here is waiting for you, and what you need to do is just sparing time to get there and check out. I assure you that Every time you read in the library, every different surprise is to be discovered. Most of us might now know exactly what our major is all about, what we're gonna learn in this major. But after a period of exploration, confusion, and utter bafflement, we may find ourselves obsessed with our major after we learn more about it. So keep an open mind and always have a good attitude while learning our major. Because life is like a box of chocolates, you never know what you're gonna get. Just be fully present, fully conscious to your life and to all that's around us. If we just keep our feet on the ground, learn every course with great patience and unfailing endurance, I'm sure we'll thank ourselves for such hard work the moment we're about to graduate from D9 University four years from now. This very moment marked the start of our new journey a journey to a whole new world, a more challenging and fascinating one which will mean even more to every one of us and entail a lot more hard work, mental power, and very rational thoughts. I promise, as every fellow student of mine does, I will do my best to honor myself and parents and of course, our university. Thus, we'll have no regrets after the four year life in Jinan. Every opportunity is earned by no one but yourself. So just go for your dreams and build your future. Thank you, that's all I wanna say.